Hey guys, I'm here in Estonia. Um, just a quick topic here I explain here, and this is something I think that most people here can benefit from. Opening a bank account is not very difficult in Russia, and this is something so many people have this impression, especially in the US, that it's so difficult opening a bank account. And this is not the case. I actually have two bank accounts in Russia. One is Raffaisen and the other is Spear Bank. And this is actually one of the better countries to open a bank account in my experience. Now I live in Estonia, it's actually more difficult and more troublesome opening a bank account here with one of their bank providers like LHV or Swedbank than it is in Estonia or in Russia. And this is really surprising for most people to hear, but this is the case. Keep in mind the US has a lot of policies and protocol with international banks for US citizens. If US citizens bank elsewhere, they have to follow a lot of policies, the, these banks that are in line with the US government because they want to know about income and, and for taxes and all these legal procedures that come from the citizen, US citizen. Overall, the banking experience is quite different than most people expect in the States. When I got to Russia, I was able to open both bank accounts that I have, one in Spearbank, Raffaisen. I'll probably do a video on the process of opening a bank account when I'm back there. I was able to open each of these bank accounts within a couple hours. It was all completed. One of these bank accounts has, or both of them actually had no fees. They don't have monthly fees. With my bank account here in Estonia, I have fees. The, on top of that, like uh, transfer fees and other um, like interest rates are better in, in, in my Russian bank account. O overall, just a better experience. The employees are, are generally friendlier in the Russian banks. They're more helpful and language isn't a big issue. There, there's not, not a language divide that exists like in people would expect. Now, Russia obviously is, they're really wanting to expand their client base, these banks, and keep in mind that as a foreign person, once you get your residency, not citizenship, you can build a credit score to a Russian bank and eventually, it's kind of like the US credit score system, you can get access to credit lines and use credit to buy property. This is actually an open opportunity many people don't understand. And this exists uh, for, for foreign people. I think it would be very wise for people, foreign people, to consider a, a bank account such as a country like Russia. Not because of the currency, because the currency is, is weaker, but because of the way that you can safeguard yourself from potential problems in the West. I've learned living abroad that Western banking systems are all tied together. It doesn't matter if it's Germany, US, anywhere. It's, it's all tied together. England, Estonia, these countries have very conjoined policies. Banking by nature is international and th this is so important to realize. In countries like Russia, some of the few where I'm not saying that government can't know what you're doing or about certain details, but they won't have the same power to come in and steal like they can in Western countries. Yes, people have some discomfort about the banking system in Russia, but it's important to understand the natural bias that's there and the fact that they also have their own criminals and other issues within their own country they have to confront. So this often gets a lot more publicity than the positive publicity about the banking system. So all in all, I'd say it's a good experience. My recommendation is go and open a bank account in, in Russia, very easy. You just need some simple documents and you'll be good to go. So give me your feedback, thanks.